It's huge. What's bigger than Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton's ego? Huge. Wait, that's us. That's right, they're going to be huge. (laughs) You're listening to The Drive Home with Matt and Taylor. And you're listening to The Drive Home with Matt and Taylor. I'm your host, Matt Burton. And as always, the beautiful Miss Taylor Cook. Yes, it's me. Yes. Boom. One of, one of these days, mm-hmm. you're going to announce me in. Yep. And Is it going to be that exciting, though? No. You don't think so? <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> glad you know about that. No, I'm kidding. Anyway, so, Taylor. Yeah, what's up? Have you ever had to move back in with your parents? Yes. Have it, you? It, I moved out when I was like 19 and I shouldn't have. Like, I know that I shouldn't have now. Mm -hmm. I think I was too young to move out, but I did it, whatever. And, um. How'd that work out? It did it, obviously. I ended (laughs) back at home with my parents. But, and like, I wanted to like act like a big, big girl and not need mommy and daddy, but man, did I need them. So when I moved back, I was like disappointed in myself. But me moving back. It kind of made me realize, like, how thankful I should really be, like, to actually, like, be with my parents and to tell and, like, see, like, what all they do to me, like, for me and my groceries and stuff like that. Like, yeah. it's not it's not cheap. So, I mean, it, it 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 was hard on me, but I think it resulted in this is what I needed to do. It was mm-hmm. a good, well, lesson learned. Sure. It was a good, well, lesson learned. Well, we have a couple reasons. Now, these are not... This is not our reasoning. Mm -hmm. Top reasons you're moving back in with your parents after college. Uh huh. And some people do that. Yes, I have some friends that are still living at home, and they're and they're they're like they have a judgment. They have big adult jobs. No, Mm -hmm. no judgment. You Mm -hmm. know, whatever. So number one, entry pay in your career field twenty five thousand a year. Rent in your area twenty five thousand a month. Oh my gosh. I, th- I mean, I think it's a good enough reason to stay at home with mommy. Um, yeah, wait, who is living somewhere where it's 25? Where are you, the Hamptons? <laughs> yeah. Where are you living at? And what are you doing in the what Hamptons? What are you doing in the Hamptons making $25,000 a year? Oh, I'm uh, done I, with I that think person. The, the people that want people's dog makes that. That person's an idiot. Yeah. Oh, I cannot even. Go back to college. Right? Exactly. <laughs> Go back to college. Oh, my gosh. I can't. Uh Oh my gosh! What's the, the next amount? One? <laughs> this is this oh is God. crazy. Amount of student loan debt seventy five grand. Uh huh. Your degree, basket weaving. That's a degree. I, who knows? It's probably somewhere in like China, making all of her stuff. You sure about that? Uh huh. I think so. Um, now I mean, like my myself and my girlfriend, mm-hmm. we're Italian. No, we're using the girlfriend. Yeah, her. you know, actually, that I've been sounds using, good. I, I've, huh? I've, I've been using her more and more in the show. That sounds good. You're yes. getting comfy, huh? Yes, <laughs> yes. I love staying in touch with your love life. Yes. As long as she doesn't end up on stupid news, we're good. Yes. <laughs> or us together on stupid news, you know. That's true. Your col your your college IKEA furniture collapsed and buried your prospective roommate. Where did that? Is this real? This is the top top reasons. I mean, here what here here at the drive home with Matt and Taylor, we don't give false things. We don't. We have to cite everything we do. Yeah, we do. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this could come from the Matt Burton collection. <laughs> it cannot. Y- you could either get an apartment and drive a Kia, or live with your mom and drive a BMW. Touche. Touche. I feel you, Touché. bro. I feel you. I'm not gonna hate on you, yep. bro. <sighs> Why having 10 kids <laughs> living off the government? <laughs> saving up. Now, this one I could understand. Mm-hmm. Saving up for an iPhone 7. No. No. I don't understand. Taylor, are you living with someone now? Am I living with someone? Yeah. I'm living with me and my roommate, Amanda, my best friend, Amanda. Why aren't you on your own? Are you saving up for the new iPhone 7? No, I'm not. I'm kidding. I can't afford a iPhone I mean, I 7. Could. No, the thing is with the whole iPhone 7 thing, I'm going to have an upgrade and I'll just get it cheaper that way. I'm not going to save up you, for it. You, you didn't get a degree in broadcasting. You really got a degree in basket weaving, didn't you? I did. I did. <laughs> That's why I live with my parents. Living with your parents is a great way to use that psychology degree. 
Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> what is he giving his parents counseling sessions? Yeah. That's terrible. Or no, I mean, you're having to use it on yourself for living with. That's terrible. It's punishment for your involvement in deflate gate. Oh my gosh. Is that the whole Tom Brady thing? Yeah. Which was. You Are know, we over know, that or not? I am. I mean, I'm a Patriots fan. I mean, I mean can like, we please you know, be over it? <laughs> Mom's leftovers are a step up from six days a week of Roman noodles. Ramen noodles. It's not Roman. Is your- it's not Roman. <laughs> that, that, that was a test and you passed. Your boyfriend has an apartment and you've been secretly living with him. So what? Like you're secretly living with your boyfriend, but you're not coming home to at your parents' house. My mom would be like, "Where the heck are you?" Yeah, like you're you're living with him. Like, but but you're still living with your mom. You're quote unquote probably because he doesn't. They don't want to tell the parents that she's. Yes. But that's the thing. Like, my mom would be like, "Where are you? Like, why aren't you coming home?" That's a respect thing. Yep. You don't just come and go as you please. Living with your mom and dad is less painful than selling a kidney. <laughs> <laughs> That's terrible. Yep, I got to sell a kidney to get out on my own to get this $25,000 a month apartment. Or. The to- or. You know what the top one is? What? You need a year to mourn the loss of Prince. Hey, you know what? Purple rain, That's baby. That's fine, boo-boo. That's Purple fine. Do, rain. do your thing. Do your thing. Do your thing. Do your thing. Anyway, you've been listening to The Drive Home with Madden Taylor. Hang tight. We'll be right back. 